when a dam is constructed on a river, um, for one, it prevents the ability from uh, a fish like the paddlefish who, who will swim uh, a long way in a river. It prevents them from being able to move upstream uh, in the river. Um, but the other thing it does, it alters the river flow um, downstream um, of that reservoir. Um, many times the river flow is reduced to the point where um, the river can't operate as it would naturally. Um, in an in a unimpounded river, you have seasonal higher flow periods. The faster water is flowing through a river channel, the more sediment that it will carry downstream, which uh, helps to keep um, areas of gravel uh, clear in the riverbed. And gravel is, is one of the preferred substrates for paddlefish to spawn on. Um, when, when paddlefish spawn, uh, eggs are fertilized, they will adhere to, um, pretty much the first thing they'll come in contact with. And, and that's usually gravel is, is what that is. So if you have slower moving water because a dam upstream has created that situation, sediment will uh, settle in on gravel um, and and cover up those gravel beds, so you don't have the the preferred uh, required spawning habitat that paddlefish need. The other thing that happens is you, if if the dam has created a situation where it's more of a, a a constant release, a lower release of water downstream, you don't have uh, spring generally spring pulses and higher water flows that, that come and cue uh, fish, like the paddlefish, that it's time to spawn. So paddlefish are interesting in that you know, they're a long-lived species, and generally to be able to, to uh, maintain their population, they don't have to spawn every year. Um, but if you have situations in a river where um, – Spawning is disrupted because you don't have natural flow cues, or if you don't have uh, preferred or required spawning habitat, well then if it happened on a year that you know, the paddlefish would spawn, well then you you miss that opportunity, and then numbers will continue to decline. You need you need that higher flow combined with the the, the amount of uh, daylight at that time of year and, and, and temperatures also. So um, the, the way that dams change the, the natural ecology of the river flow downstream uh, can be very disruptive to paddlefish and other species that, that use the river.